hello, my name is Ricardo Torres and uh, I'm from Mexico and I'm an ex myself student. Uh, I belong to the cohort in 2020 and uh, well I finished uh, the master program in 2022, just uh, a few months ago. And... Uh, well, I studied my bachelor in Mexico, in the National Autonomous University of Mexico. Uh, I studied nanotechnology and uh, during my studies I had several lectures related to material science but since nanotechnology is already a quite broad uh, area I wanted to, to do a master's degree in something more uh, focused on something specific and I really liked the material science lectures I had during my bachelor uh, so I wanted to, to, to pursue this, this uh, path of material science, but also I wanted to do something more related to material science. I started to look for, for uh, different programs uh, around the world, and I found this MAMASELF program which has this extra of uh, focus in large-scale facilities. At that point, I didn't have any idea of what was a large-scale facility. But uh, uh, since there was this extra thing apart from material science, I wanted to try it. And uh, yeah, that's, that's why I'm here. It's uh, material science plus something, a new uh, beautiful world that, that are these large scale facilities. Synchrotrons, neutron uh, facilities and, and uh, X-ray free electron lasers. <laughs> What is special about Mama Self is that it's a, a, an international program uh, where you can choose uh, to study in different universities, uh, depending on your background, depending on your interests. And in my case, uh, I decided to stay in uh, the University of Rennes uh, here for my first year. And for the second year, uh, I went to a University Adam Mickiewicz in, in Poznan, in Poland. Uh, in these uh, both universities, uh, we focus more on uh, physics, fundamental physics. Uh, here in Rennes, uh, we were focusing more on uh, statistical physics, crystallography, uh, quantum mechanics, uh, uh, phase transitions. And in Poznan, it was more, uh, more related to, to theoretical physics. Uh, we were analyzing some magnetism, some ultra-fast uh, um, spectroscopies, uh, solid-state physics. And, uh, well, I decided to follow this path because I, I liked uh, the, the physics approach of material science. And also, well, I, when I was in Mexico, I never imagined of at one point of my life living in Poland. And uh, it... I just can say it, it was amazing. I, I fell in love with with Poland. <laughs> Having these these both experiences in France and in Poland, it just like it's a sum and some summing and summing summing experience, and it's uh, just wonderful. All the the things that you can learn from people with different point of views and uh, different experiences. <laughs> Uh, one of the most interesting and most important parts of Mama Self is uh, all the experience that you can gain from it, not only from the academic point of view, which is already a lot, but also from real life, uh, real interaction with people. You can find people from all over the world with, uh, with many different points of view, many different ways of uh, seeing life uh, or interacting with, with people, uh, different cultures, even the different traditions, different food. Uh, those are experiences that that only get some and some and some to, to your own own experience and your own way of, of seeing life. So it's it just... Your life is getting richer and richer and, and richer. <laughs> And uh, another uh, important aspect of Mama Self is the opportunity that you have to attend or to go to these uh, large scale facilities 
for example, during my uh, Master One internship, I was able to to go to to participate in some experiments at, at the ESRF, the European Synchrotron Radiation Facility, uh, where, where I learned a lot, because uh, it's not only just doing calculations, it's like science in real life. And uh, after that, for my Master Two internship, my, my thesis uh, project, uh, I, I decided to stay in Poland, in Poznan. We went also to, to do some experiments at European XFEL in Hamburg. And uh, well, the, my, my master thesis was, uh, I guess it's the beauty of material science that it just involves many different uh, areas of science, physics, chemistry, biology. In my case, I was working uh, with uh, catalysts, it's uh, some systems called uh, diets, which you have a photosensitizer and a catalyst, and the main objective is to gain the energy from sunlight and and uh, just move this energy to the catalyst so that the catalyst can. Uh, in this case, we were trying to to reduce protons to to get some hydrogen uh, and use it as a fueler, uh, solar fuel. <laughs> It's like uh, growing in every possible way in your personal life, in, in what you know in school. It, it, it's just a program so complete. And in, in uh, particular, Mama Self, uh, you have the, the option of, of broadening your, your network. That opens lots of doors. Of course, you, you have to knock the door, and but the doors are there for, for you in, in the Mama Self program. And uh, well, now one of those doors uh, I knocked and it opened. Uh, it's uh, now I'm doing my PhD here at the University of Rennes uh, in the physics department with, with one professor I had during uh, my, my stay here in Mama Self program in Rennes. And uh, well, it's just a wonderful experience. I, I, I really enjoy staying here uh, in, uh, in the physics department in the University of Rennes. Going back to, to the time where, where I, when I was applying, uh, now I can say that it, it was uh, completely worth it, not only in the academic part, also in my personal life. I've, I think that I've grown a lot uh, and now I have many, many friends from different parts of the world and uh, it's, it's so, so nice to, to know that you're not alone. <laughs> you have a, a huge network and you can count of many people in different parts of, of the world.